726 WIBX. So um, on this sleep thing, there is a video, and I'll put another one in there too, where I have that moment where I wake up, and this usually, uh, according to my wife, happens one or two times a night, uh, where you just sit right up out of a sound sleep, and now sometimes that leads to getting out of bed and, and as the doctor said, uh, um, acting out the dream. But um, the sleep apnea thing is, is pretty interesting. And the, you'll see in the video, if you go to the Keeler page at WIBX's website, uh, you'll see the graph. And the graph actually shows the period where you stop breathing. And oh I think one of these went like 40 seconds. I didn't, I didn't breathe. And so with his chest and abdominal wall movement. Oh, he, he describes this a little bit in the video. considered normal. However, what's coming up is what is a classic what we call obstructive apneic event whereby his chest continues to show excursion which indicates he's attempting to breathe yet there's no airflow coming out from his nose which indicates that there's an obstruction he's, he's breathing in terms of chest wall movements but no air is coming out from his uh, airways because his upper airway is obstructed, with an a, 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 which is creating an apneic yeah. event. And it, and it went like uh, 40, 30 seconds sometimes, somewhere like 20 seconds. One was as long as 40 seconds long, though. Um, so, and, and the depriving your brain of oxygen can't be a good thing over time and over time. And they say that can right. lead to stroke and other things. Uh, and being overweight, and it can lead to... Certainly what, what you end up when you're not sleeping well, you're tired all day long, which uh, the only cure to that is, uh, is Death Wish Coffee and the name in itself. <laughs> the name itself just kind of tells you where you're going with that, right? So I'll continue with that, and I'll put another video up, too, in there, but it's on our website, and you can check it out. Kind of interesting. And I can't be the only person out there that is, uh, not only suffers from this but doesn't get it treated. Uh, if it wasn't for my wife making me do this, I probably wouldn't do it. Uh, birthdays here for today, uh, March 29th. John DeBona in Utica is celebrating today. And Kathy Schmeck, S-C-H-E, uh, Schemke? Schemke. Okay. Sorry about that, Kathy. Kathy Schemke from Schuyler is uh, celebrating a birthday today as well. And the cake goes to John DeBona of Utica. John gets a cake from the Florentine Pastry Shop on Bleecker Street in Utica. You can join our VIP club and submit your birthday online at WYBX950.com, or you can send in a postcard, WYBX Birthdays, 9418 River Road, Marcy 13403. We'll talk to pharmacist Bob Black from Randall's Pharmacy coming up about uh, these new e-scripts. Also, give you a chance to win our free money question of the day from the Hobica Law Firm. $100, $200, or $300 on the line. Coming up, news is next on WYBX.